Welcome to Minister Ryan. Um, I suppose what we have before us today, it's, it's not just an amended bill. What it actually is, is, is it's a statement of intent. We have a list of projects. And I think that if we can continue in that manner to actually show what's the practical ramifications of the bills that we pass, that that's the best way to actually get the public on board. We are seeing a number of these projects. They're dealing with climate in tandem with fuel poverty. Let's continue that. Let's show that this is a government and this is a house and across both houses that's actually putting in place the practical measures that can change people's lives. And I welcome an awful lot of the suggestions here today, which really shows that we are all on board with a climate action fund. And on top of the, the measures that are outlined here, what I'm particularly excited about is that second round, because as was highlighted earlier by Senator Murphy, today is the closing date for um, applications for the Just Transition Fund. That gets people really excited. They can say, let me put forward my innovative suggestions for how to deal with climate, but how also to help my community. And when I look at some of the community energy projects that people have tried to start to get off the ground, and in my own constituency in Galway, it's been incredibly difficult to do that, and I've tried to help communities to do that. But what I'd love to see, and I'd love the Minister to come in on this, is how can we make it easier for people to, um, to really put these things into, into action? Um, we have the, the Aran Islands community at, at the co-op, energy co-op. That's been really successful, but that took years of effort from a really dedicated group of people who were living close together. But there are other things that through the SCAI uh, grant scheme, that people have found it much more difficult. So I think fantastic that we see that we have this second round, but I'd love to hear some more about how we can make it easier for people to not just access funding, but to get their projects off the ground. So thank you very much for coming in. I'm not going to take any more time. Um, and I welcome the bill and the, amended, uh, and the amendments that you have said that you will look at further down the line, but that every day that, every day that we, we, um, we fail to pass this, we're losing money. So I think let's pass this, let's take on board all of the suggestions and let's work together across the houses. Thank you.